Thanks to their regal, fluffy coats, Pomeranians are some of the most distinctive small dogs. And while some dogs with a lot of hair shed surprisingly little, the Pom does not fall into that category. Do Pomeranians shed? Yes, these dogs are considered moderate to heavy shedders. What makes them shed more than other dogs of similar size? How much fur can you expect to see around your home if you own a Pomeranian? And, most importantly, how can you ensure your Pom's coat stays healthy and reduce their shedding? Keep on watching to learn the answers to these questions as we explore Pomeranian shedding. How much do Pomeranians shed? Do Pomeranians shed more than other dogs? Yes, these little dogs shed more than single-coated breeds because they have two layers of fur. As moderate to heavy shedders, you can expect to see dog hair on your clothing after you've held your palm, and you'll probably notice it on your furniture and carpets, too. If you have a Pomeranian puppy or plan to adopt one, you should know that puppies go through a stage when they shed their puppy fur so they can grow a mature adult coat, a phase commonly known as the puppy uglies. During this time, the fur may grow unevenly and the coat can even change color. Don't worry, though, your pup will look a little scruffy for a while but should have their full adult coat by about 10 months of age. How to control your Pomeranian's shedding? Do Pomeranians shed a lot? Yes, these dogs are moderate to heavy shedders year-round, and they'll exhibit excessive shedding twice a year when they blow their coats. So, what can current or prospective palm owners do to keep all that hair at bay? While palms will always shed a fair amount, there are the surprisingly simple ways to keep your Pomeranian's coat healthy while minimizing shedding. Brushing. Regular brushing isn't just a great way to keep your dog looking dapper. It's also good for their skin and fur. Brushing smooths any tangles and spreads natural skin oils through the fur to moisturize the coat. Plus, brushing keeps loose hair from spreading through your home. Brush your Pomeranian daily, or at least a few times a week to keep it from ending up on your floors and furniture. Consult your vet to find out what kind of brush might work best for your dog's coat of fur. There are slicker brushes, pin brushes, bristle brushes, and beyond. Wondering if it's okay to brush your Pomeranian's coat when they're going through the puppy uglies? The answer is yes, the hair is going to fall out eventually anyway, so there's no harm in grooming your dog regularly during their puppy shedding phase. Just remember to be gentle. Bathing. Bathing your dog occasionally is another good way to get rid of excess dog fur and minimize shedding. Always use a dog shampoo, because shampoo made for humans or other animals could irritate your palm's sensitive skin. Remember not to overdo it. Bathing too frequently can actually dry out the skin, which can lead to more shedding and even full-fledged hair loss. A good tip is to bathe your dog monthly. If you aren't interested in bathing your dog yourself, you can always visit a professional groomer. Many Pomeranian dog owners use grooming services to keep their beloved pets' long, fluffy coats looking stylish. Feeding a great diet. Do Pomeranians shed more when they don't receive adequate nutrition? Absolutely. Feeding your pooch properly is one of the best ways to make sure your dog's skin and coat remain healthy. Ask your veterinarian for a recommendation on a quality food choice if you think your dog's current food might not be up to par. Want to give your palm's coat an extra nutritional boost? Try supplements to add a little something extra to your pooch's diet. Preventing pests. A pest infestation has the potential to make your dog shed even more than usual. Fleas, ticks, mites, lice, and other external pets can quickly result in hair loss, hot spots, severe itching, and other health issues if not addressed. The easiest thing to do is avoid the problem with pest preventatives. Ask your vet to set your palm up with a flea and tick preventative, as well as heartworm medication, to keep pests at bay. Cleaning fur in the home. Our last tip isn't for your pet, but for your home. Regular vacuuming and dusting will help keep loose fur from lying around your home and reduce your exposure to allergens. A robot vacuum cleaner can help clean up fur without you needing to come into close contact with it. You can also adopt creative solutions like putting cheesecloth over your vents to prevent the spread of fur throughout the house. Lastly, if you're sensitive to pet dander, you might want to consider keeping your palm off furniture and away from the bedroom. 